Hi, I'm Dr. Alan Weider from MassageChairRelief.com and today I'm going to show you how to use your new Daiwa Pegasus 2 massage chair for the first time. Uh, take your shoes off so that your feet or your shoes don't uh, wear out the material underneath your feet, but also so you can feel the foot massage. Make sure that the calf airbags don't fold over. That's not just a problem uh, with, uh, with this chair, that happens with a lot of chairs. Always make sure that your, your calf airbags don't uh, uh, fold over. And then put yourself back into the chair, situate yourself back in the chair, even if your feet don't hit the bottom of the of the foot rollers, it doesn't matter because the chair is not designed to be like a recliner that you sit in with your feet all the way down to the bottom. This is a chair that's designed to, like most massage chairs, designed to recline back, the legs come up and meet your feet, and then it's a perfect fit for you, and the chair should scan you that way. Now, uh, the remote control is very simple. To get started, the first thing you want to do is turn on the power, and you, it, it, you can turn on the power, and right away you can hear the side arm, the side arm rests adjusting. You see that they're going in and out. And as soon as I turn, and it's so it's basically scanning my shoulder width. I don't, can you, I don't know if you can see that, but the, the, the side arms go in, out, in and out, and that's to, to kind of, uh, it's, it's scanning my, sh my shoulder width so that the, the, the size of, the, of the, 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 the width of the chair is comfortable for my fit. And there are people who are broader, have broader shoulders than I do, and this chair will accommodate them, but there's also people who are more slight than I, and it'll accommodate them as well. But when you turn on the program, this chair will go through that, that sizing with the, with the armrest. And then all you do then is uh, select OK for the auto programs and press again OK and it will turn on the program. It has already scanned my wi the width of my shoulders. Now it's coming out. You notice this chair is a wall hugger so you'll see the, the chair is sliding forward on the base and then once it reaches out uh, or reaches its, its, its furthest, it's about a foot out. Once it reaches out about a foot the chair will recline like it's doing now. My hands are in place and it's a very comfortable hand, uh, hand uh, placement. And then make sure you always keep your head back and now see how the foot is now uh, reach, uh, extending out uh, and it's coming back to measure my feet. Uh, most electronic extenders do the same thing and now you're set to go. The width of the shoulders was uh, was uh, figured out right when I turned on the chair. The feet turn on once I've started the uh, once I've started the, the program itself or the feet measuring uh, be, uh, occurs when I turn on the chair and now I'm in my program and I'm just relaxing and and enjoying the experience. Uh, the calves, and you'll notice the calves now, you'll see that the airbags are uh, inflated but also rubbing my calves. That's we call that calf kneading or the calf rub. Uh, it also has rollers behind the calves uh, massaging the back of my calves. So this is how the uh, this is how you get started on this chair. And when it gets going, you'll notice things going on. Like you'll notice the uh, the rollers, of course, going up and down your back. You'll notice one arm and then the other inflate. Then you'll notice the calf airbags inflate and rub. And then you'll feet, notice the foot rollers on. And you can adjust the position. You can bring the chair up higher or bring it back lower. You can extend the legs or bring the legs back. Uh, you can. Uh, adjust the intensity of the airbags, adjust the depth of the rollers, you can adjust all that in these programs. But uh, but just to get started, that is all you need to do to get started. And then you can maybe, while you're doing this, you can read your new owner's manual. And then when you're done, or you can just let it go until the chair shuts down, or you can turn it off by pressing the power button again, and now everything shuts down and the chair is restored to the uh, neutral upright position. And that is all you need to do to get started on this chair. It's an easy chair to function or to operate, and the functions are easy to handle and, and change and adjust. Uh, very nice chair. Anyways, that's the uh, first time use of the Daiwa Pegasus 2 Smart Massage Chair. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please feel free to thumbs up like us on our YouTube channel and help us spread the word about massage chairs by sharing this video on your on your social media platforms. I appreciate that. I'm Dr. Alan Widener from MassageChairRelief.com and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.